was a Holocaust survivor who came to Israel and fought in Israel's war of independence. He is here to share his story. Shalom lekulam. Shmi Daniel Shafran. My name is Daniel Shafran. I was born in Poland in 1927 to a family of seven kids. I was 13 when World War II started. One day, they took my two younger brothers, Imjashin. They told us that they are taking them to a school and their life will be much better. I haven't seen them since then. My older brother served in the Polish military. I haven't seen him either since the war. He was most likely killed in Auschwitz. The rest of my family, including myself, were deported to Logic Ghetto and from there to Auschwitz, where my mother was burned in the crematorium. My sisters did not survive the war, but to this day, I do not know where they perished. My brother and myself survived the dead march and after three weeks of walking, the war was over. We traveled to Hamburg and from there to Marseille. There I learned Hebrew and met. After approximately six months, we boarded a ship. The ship was Champollion on our way to Israel. We got off the boat in Atlit as part of our Yut Aliyah organization. We were sent to Kibbutz Kiryat Anavim near Jerusalem. That is where I learned for the first time how to operate weapons. During the British mandate, I also served as a police officer, after which I joined the Palmach and instructed immigrants coming from North Africa, from Algeria, Morocco. During the independence war, I was stationed at Baba Wad on the ridges leading to Jerusalem, and I guarded the convoys delivering supplies and weapons to the besieged Jerusalem. The mission was to ensure the Arabs are not shooting at our vehicles and blocking the passage to Jerusalem. After the war, the IDF was created, and I joined the Air Force as an airplane controller, where I served until 1953. In 1956, the Sinai War erupted, and I was drafted as a reserve force into the Air Force. Now I'm 91 years old. I have been through a lot in my life. I have lost my family in the Holocaust and my brethren during the War of Independence. Despite all of that, I am still hopeful. Shalom.